Hi there, welcome. I'm Will. Today's Bible story is about a man who was paralyzed. He couldn't walk and needed help. So the man's friends carried him to Jesus. There was a problem though. The friends couldn't get to Jesus. There were too many people in the way. Watch this video to see what the friends did. Jesus had been traveling and he went back to Capernaum. When the people in the town heard that Jesus was home, they gathered at the house to hear him teach. Pharisees and other teachers of the law had traveled from villages all over Galilee and Judea. Some even came from Jerusalem to hear Jesus. So many people came that they stood in the doorway and there was no room for anyone else. Just then, four men came to the house. They were carrying their friend on a mat because he could not walk. They tried to bring their friend to Jesus because they wanted Jesus to heal him. But they could not get through the crowd. So the men carried their friend up to the roof. They took off the roof above Jesus. Then they lowered their friend through the crowd so that he was right in front of Jesus. Jesus saw that the friends had faith. He told the man lying on the mat, young man, your sins are forgiven. When the religious leaders heard this, they thought, who does Jesus think he is? He is being disrespectful to God. Only God can forgive sins. Jesus knew what the religious leaders were thinking. He said to them, why are you thinking like that? Is it easier for me to say to this man, your sins are forgiven or get up and walk? As God's son, Jesus had the power to forgive people's sins, but how could he prove that the man's sins were really forgiven? So Jesus showed his power on earth to forgive his sins by turning back to the man on the mat. Get up, pick up your mat and go home, Jesus said. The man who had been unable to walk immediately got up. He picked up his mat and he went home just like Jesus commanded. Everyone in the crowd saw what happened and they could hardly believe what they had seen. They praised God and said, we have never seen anything like this. The man who was paralyzed needed to be healed. Jesus knew this and did something even greater. Jesus forgave his sins and then he healed the man. Because Jesus is God, he has the power and authority to heal and forgive. Jesus offers forgiveness to those who trust in him. The four men had faith. Instead of giving up, they cut a hole in the roof and lowered their friend to Jesus. Jesus healed the man so he could walk, but Jesus did something even greater. He forgave the man's sins. Jesus could forgive the man's sins because he was going to take the punishment for sin when he died on the cross.